Hi. Now let us discuss about the simple interest. The simple interest which is given by the expression i is equal to p into r into t by 100 where i is the simple interest that is the simple interest is money paid only on the principal and p is the principal principal is the amount of money borrowed or invested and r is the rate of interest rate of interest is the percentage charged or earned and t is the time that is the time that the money is borrowed or invested in years few of the definitions are in, in simple interest are the principal the money borrowed or lent out for a certain period is called the principal or the sum the interest the extra money paid for using others money is called interest and the simple interest if the interest on a sum borrowed for a certain period is recorded uniformly then it is called a simple interest let p be the principal r be the rate in percentage per annum and t be the time in years then the simple interest is given by the expression simple interest is equal to p into r into t by 100 from this expression we can identify the principal amount by using the formula p is equal to 100 into si by r into t where r is the rate of interest t is the time and si is the simple interest also we can find the rate of interest by using the formula r is equal to 100 into si by p into t and similarly we can find the value of time by using the formula t is equal to 100 into si by p into r few of the important formulas of simple interest are here p r and T stands for principal, rate and time respectively and SI stands for simple interest. Then the expressions are given as P is equal to 100 into SI by R into T to calculate the principal amount and T is equal to 100 into SI by P into R to calculate the duration and r is equal to 100 into si by p into t to calculate the rate of interest and si is equal to p into r into t by 100 to calculate the simple interest now let us see some example problems on simple interest the problem is Find the simple interest on rupees 2000 at 5 percentage per annum for 3 years. Also find the amount. Here from the given question, so the options given are option A is 2200, option B is 2300, option C is 2000 and option D is 2100. So from the given question, it is clear that the principal amount P is 2000 rupees and the rate of interest R is 5 percentage and the time is 3 years that is T is equal to 3 years. So substituting the known value in the simple interest formula SI is equal to P into R into T by 100 we get 2000 into 5 into 3 by 100 and solving this equation we get 30,000 by 100 which is equal to 300 therefore the simple interest is equal to 300 so the next question is we have to find the total amount so the total amount is equal to the principal amount plus the interest amount so the principal amount is 2000 and the interest amount is 300 which is equal to 
2000 plus 300 which implies 2300. Therefore, the option B, 2300 is the answer.